Hi guys, so welcome to my channel. So I'm gonna do the next 48 from now till Wednesday for Virgo. So let's go ahead and see what are the energies coming in for the sign of Virgo. What do they need to see or acknowledge? Virgo. What are the energies surrounding Virgo? Wow, look at that. Okay, so I think two of cups wanted to come out. <laughs> there's a partnership, a union, there's mutual love, understanding, or friendship between you and another person. It's a really good bond that you have here with someone. The feelings are mutual. It's supported by the lovers, which is a blessing. Archangel Raphael, the sun shining, coming down and blessing people. Okay, there is this energy of rescue me, which is mother and child. It's the feeling where somebody wants to be helped or you want to help someone. All right, what's in the recent past? Wow, three of pentacles, teamwork, working together. There may have been multiple people. This could be at work. Okay, so what is coming in? Aries energy, queen of wands, queen of fire. You could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries Leo or Sagittarius. Somebody who's like the boss, but they're very kind. They're the energy of, I get everything done. Give me a hundred tasks and I'll finish all of it. I'll do it all. Somebody with a lot of fire, a lot of energy, um, could be like an entrepreneur. Wow. So we have the sun, happiness, great joy, great success. You know, the po most positive card in the tarot is the sun. It means the sun gives everything life and growth, happiness. It gives you joy. It gives you abundance. So you have the sun coming in. You have a blessing. I don't know what this is, but it's something maybe divine blessings. Okay, so you're in an energy of a hangman where you're waiting. You could be having a wake-up call, some kind of enlightenment during this period. Information comes in very quickly with the Knight of Swords. Flies in, like rushing in, hot off the press. <laughs> Information hot off the press. Okay, we have the energy of Gemini. Manifestation, magician, it's somebody who literally is a magician like they can make anything happen and gemini's are very resourceful but this is anybody any zodiac you're wanting to be the magician or you're wanting to have someone be the magician we have the queen of cups water sign compassion so there's somebody in this situation here who's very compassionate could be two women there's a lot of compassion and this makes you very happy. Something good comes of this. What is the Queen of Cups? What is the Queen of Cups? Okay, we have Eight of Cups. Feeling like you wanna walk away. Victory comes in. Charging in. Charging ahead towards a victory. Queen of Cups is very emotional. You might just put your feelings aside during this time and be like, well, my feelings don't really matter. I, I just need to win. I'm determined to move forward. That's why you're coming up with Queen of Wands energy. I feel like Queen of Wands is you. This is like, I'm all fire. What is the rescue me card? Who needs to be rescued? Okay, there's indecision. Could be something to do with like a, a child you're dealing with. Ooh, and the Empress. Abundance. The energy of Venus. Could be a mother. 
This could be the energy of like fertility. Somebody's having another child. Okay, so what is the hangman? What is the hangman? Ooh, so there's an ace of coin. There's a new potential given to you, a gift from the universe. So as you're waiting, the gift comes in. So what is this Knight of Swords? What is this information that comes in? Okay, there's a decision here with the Hierophant. Could be the government, could be a court. Something comes in and it rushes in and you put your feelings aside and you charge forward. You just move ahead. What is the, what is the chariot? What is the chariot? Heavy burdens, more responsibility. Wow, look at this, the victory. So there's two cards of victory right here. Ooh, and the fool card, liberation, freedom. Bottom of the deck is the world, which is a completed cycle, but it's also about great success. It's like winning the Olympics, where you train, you go, you do it, then you win, and you're given the medal, so what's next? Um, somebody gives you something, could be a job offer, could be an email, could be a contract, could be a lump sum of money, but it comes to you and it's a gift when it comes to you. It's a decision here. Now the Hierophant is, is clarifying this fast moving information. It's coming from either operations, it's coming from a large company, a large institution, a bureaucracy. Okay. So let me just see what the oracles are saying about this. You're taking charge with the Queen of Wands. You're taking, you're holding the wand of fire. You could be literally like lighting a fire under someone, like get started, do it. Not literally lighting a fire, but like motivating somebody. Getting, being ambitious. What do we have here for Virgo? I almost said Cancer, so some of you might be dealing with that Cancer. Could be an air sign around you as well. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius with the Knight of Swords. Somebody comes rushing in, very dramatic. There's the birth. So there could be, like I said, information about a child. We have a fated meeting. You're meant to meet someone. And then we have a queen of forces, which is somebody who is like um, a psychic, a medium, someone who's beyond the, from the other realms. They deal with the energies of the spirit realms. And they're very connected to uh, intuition. So we're coming out of a winter and into a summer. So you're coming out of a hard time into a better time. And then we have this loving the elementals. So this is about getting back to nature and loving what it is you're doing. Okay. Let's go ahead and see what's coming in for, I almost said cancer again. So... So this is for Virgo. Contemplation time, and that's exactly what the hangman is here. And I have spent time alone meditating on what you truly desire. Something is gonna be given to you though, or as you're waiting. father healing. Some of you may perhaps have issues with your father. Personal power increases as you heal these issues. Virgo. Mm. 
Wow. So we have simplify your life, eliminate clutter. A new dawn. The worst is now behind you. A positive new experiences are on the horizon. Okay, and the bottom of the deck is you, your loved ones, and your possessions are safe and protected by heaven. So I'm going to leave it here for you. Thank you very much for watching my channel and take care.